Hey everyone, welcome to Geeking Out with Melly Mel. I'm Melissa. Today we are opening these four Harry Potter mystery wands. These are actually Fantastic Beast mystery wands. These are part of the Magical Creatures series. Stay tuned. Alrighty guys, so I went to my local Walmart yesterday and I came across these. And of course, I had to get some. I got four. I'm really excited to open these because I don't have any Fantastic Beast ones. If I'm not mistaken, the price for these were either $14.95 or $14.99 a piece. I know they were just under $15 each. And there are nine ones in this series. And they look so cool, you guys. They do come with their own icon and stand. So, so cool. So, here on the back, it tells you the ones that you can get uh, from this series. You can get Albus Dumbledore. You can get Credence, Gellard Grindelwald, Lita Lestrange, Newt Scamander, Nicholas Flamel, Queenie, Rudolph Spielman, and Tina Goldstein. So again, super excited for this. I really want to get Queenie's one. I love Queenie. I think that would be a really cool one to get. Um, let's see. Um, which other one would I want to get? Um, I really like Dumbledore's wand and Tina Goldstein just because I like Tina a lot. Although Nicholas Flamel's wand looks really cool as well. Let me show you a close up of all these ones. Alrighty guys, let's get to it. I am so excited to open these. Of course, these are officially licensed by Warner Brothers. And these are by the Noble Collection. If you're familiar with the Noble Collection, they do have a lot of like really nice Harry Potter replicas, which make for amazing collectible pieces. Let me just grab my scissors real quick so that way I don't destroy the bag so let's start here okay and they do come in a nice box okay and they do say fantastic beast um all right let's see who we get in this first box and it looks like we got Nicholas Flamel's uh, wand. How cool is that? This is like a really cool looking wand. And the cool thing about them is that they are like the perfect size to just put on display like the ones that I have here. But because they are not like the fancy replica ones, these are more like toys. You can actually just take them to the park um, and do whatever you want with them. I mean, these are not interactive with the display windows at Universal Studios but these are actually really cool so let's see what else we have in here I know that this comes with the icon and the stand so this one does say Nicholas Flamel here and here we have this little piece and it does say also Nicholas Flamel on that and oh this is cool we have a nagini this little icon and it looks like you're supposed to stick it to this so let's take this out of the bag that is pretty cool it's like a, a rubbery uh texture here and here we have a little 3m sticker so i'm just gonna take it off and just uh put it here so let's go ahead and do that real quick. Oh, this is pretty cool. So it's already here. And this goes like this in the front. Or is it like this? It's like this. <laughs> 
so it goes like this i'm trying to put that in there without breaking it of course it's a little um tough to put in okay so here we have it and it would sit like this Okay, so that was a really cool way to start. And these ones are 12 inches long. So again, they are pretty good size. And let's move on to our second bag. Okay. Okay. So I would love to get Queenie. So we'll see what we get. So cool. Um, no, we got, uh, what did we get? Oh, we got Queen and Swan. Oh, that is a pretty interesting, you know, his wand is like really simple. It almost just looks like a steak or like a big nail. Um, interesting. And we're just going to get the stand out of the box. Yep, we got Credence's wand. Here we have the stand and here we have um this as well and here we have oh the bow truckle that's so cute now i was reading in the bag that the uh creature icons are like randomly in the bags now i don't know that i want to stick the bow truckle on credence's wand so i might just kind of put this to the side and put it on like a different wand maybe but let's go ahead and put this here and here we have his wand. Pretty cool. All right, so here we have box number three or wand number three. Let's see who we get. It's exciting. Now I don't have a lot of uh, Fantastic Beasts uh, pieces or collectible. This is really cool. All right, who did we get? Oh, I think we got Tina's wand. Let me just double check. Um, I think this is Tina's wand. Yep, we got Tina Goldstein. So this is another one that is like very simple. And here we have a stand. And I wonder what creature icon we are getting here. Oh, this is cute. Oh, so this is the creature icon we got uh, for Tina. Let me show you close up. Okay, so I am down to the last one. I also ended up moving the Nagini icon and actually putting it on Credence. Um, so let's see what else we have here. Whose one are we going to get? Uh, what icon are we going to have in here, right? Oh, so this is, whose one is this? Rudolf Spielman okay so this is another cool looking wand and i wonder what icon we have in here if we have the okami i'm gonna put that on tina for sure um let's see if we can get this oh my gosh we have the okami how funny is that so we're gonna put the alchemy on tina and then we're gonna see a close-up of this
And that's it you guys. Let me know in the comments down below what you thought about these fantastic beast mystery ones by the Novo collection. Let me know which one of these four was your favorite or which one would you have wanted to get? I really wanted Queenie, so maybe if I get more ones, hopefully I'll get Queenie as usual. If you love the things that I talk about, definitely subscribe, comment, like, and hit that notification bell so that you can keep on geeking out with me. Bye!